When we work together in Oregon, we win. Coalitions here in Oregon are gold, and it really is a unique place where we've been able to build strong alliances. We work together in the building in Salem at the Capitol, lobbying for different issues to really support equity, inclusion, social justice. I would say that our trajectory has been one that has been strong and has always been very aligned with the values of Si Se Puede, which are very important to Tecún and our movement. I think that the huge benefit to be able to work in coalition is A, being able to really have the folks in the communities that are most impacted by things lead the conversation. I think that's crucial. B, I think it provides us with the opportunity to bring a myriad of perspective and I think that we're really expanding what that word coalition means and who gets to be at those tables. We've been able to accomplish moving forward proactive policies. Uh, we've been able to defend and protect the most vulnerable communities in our state. We've been able to bring diverse perspectives and voices to the table, many of which who, without our partners, would go unheard or unseen. When we work in coalition, we know that we have all the people um, whose values we share are working with us. So when immigrant rights are under attack, Basic Rights Oregon wants to help organizations like CAUSA and APANO. Uh, we know that when our rights are under attack, they're going to help us too. And working with the ACLU means that if things go to courts, we're going to be able to defend our community's rights and we want to help ACLU wherever we can also. We've been able to accomplish um, a lot of different things, but one of the things that comes to mind just this year is getting the Supreme Court Chief Justice of Oregon to issue a ruling saying that ICE cannot arrest people in and around courthouses. It is the third in the nation and it is one of the most expansive. And I think in part because we all sat at tables and we were able to do the work together and planning together and we brought some of the grassroots and communities of faith that Emerge brings and work around that and the ACLU has been following up through their legal expertise around making sure that that rule, that there's a proposal for that rule and then following up on it. This work would be really hard if we didn't have partners like the ACLU. Thinking about those alliances, those deep bonds, it's always been the way that we are able to make real change in our communities. People are tired, people are exhausted. People's attentions are, you know, are, are in the news all the time. And so when Emerge says, show up here, people trust us to do that because they know we're doing that work alongside experts like people at the ACLU that are telling us this is a moment, this really, really matters. And when we do that, we actually can really make a difference. What all these coalitions are working towards, I think like a lot of those things end in justice, right? So social justice, gender justice, racial justice, economic justice. But in the simplest of terms, what I think we're fighting for are for Oregonians to be able to live their fullest lives in safe, healthy communities that each of us should be able to chart our course um, and with a minimal amount of intervention by others, by their beliefs, um, and that we get to be the authors of our own destiny.